All right, you've seen the headlines. We've all seen them. Home prices are skyrocketing and interest rates are super high and the housing supply is increasing and home prices are going to stagnate and yada, yada, yada. Let's just boil it down to the basics. Rule number one of real estate, all real estate is local. Okay. So perhaps during this holiday season, your great aunt Sally was here talking about what was happening in Sheboygan, but that's a little different than perhaps what you're experiencing in Romney or Battleground or on the south side of Lafayette. Those markets are not equitable being Greater Lafayette and Sheboygan. So there's some real estate industry experts that have been talking and here's what Jay Thompson says. The housing market headlines are everywhere. Many are quite sensational ending with exclamation points or predicting impending doom for the industry. Clickbait the sensationalizing of headlines and content has been an issue since the dawn of the internet and housing news is not immune to it. So a trusted local expert is your best resource and that's who you want to talk to so that you're not getting clickbait and headlines. So let's talk about this year. We started off with a bang thanks to the built up pandemic demand and the low interest rates and the market remained pretty hot, fiery hot, I would say, throughout the year with almost 25% of homes sold in 2022 going under contract in 24 hours or less, okay? Let's keep going through the year. Things got a little bit more interesting this fall. According to Freddie Mac, the average 30-year mortgage rate jumped from 3.22 in January all the way up to a high of 7.08 in October. Eek! That's an increase of nearly 4% in 10 months, which is like mind blowing a little bit um, to have that kind of acceleration in a 10 month period. It's pretty crazy. And I would say, yes, it did have an effect on home buyers and their willingness to buy right now or to buy this fall. So a lot of people kind of step back, took some time to reevaluate, figure out what they want to do. Okay, let's talk about Tippecanoe County stats for all of 2022. Uh, 2,166 homes sold last year, um, ranging from 20,000 at the low end. The highest priced home to sell in Tippecanoe County in 2022 was 1.325 million. Average price in Tippecanoe County, 276,398. Average days on market for all of 2022, 15. All right. Um, about 10% of those 2,100 homes that sold, sold with zero days on market. That's right. They didn't even hardly get online. And like I said already, about 24% of those sold in 24 hours or less. So, Currently active right now in all of Tippecanoe County, 138 homes. Wow. Okay, so let's look forward. What do we want in 2023? We want stability, all right? We want the Fed to bring inflation down and keep it there. And you know, the, the experts agree if inflation is high, mortgage interest rates will be high. Inflation is low, mortgage interest rates will be low. Um, We've got a little ways to go. We're coming down. We're on the we're on the right trajectory. Um, some experts are predicting that we'll be back under six percent by quarter three. Hope that's the case. Um, when it comes to home pricing, Economics 101 will always play a leading role. Supply and demand, right? If you've taken any economics classes, the more buyers and fewer homes, then the more prices will rise. So. As I just mentioned, 138 homes for sale in all of Tippecanoe County, uh, that's pretty low supply, all right? So while some experts think that home values will go up, others are anticipating they'll go down. So probably the truth is somewhere there in the middle. Um, nationally, the experts are predicting relatively flat or neutral appreciation for 2023. So 
Here's the deal. You need a local expert now more than ever. You need somebody who can talk with local banks and lenders. You need somebody that knows the local appraisers. You know somebody need somebody that knows the local inspectors. All of these things matter. You need to know what's happening in the local housing trends. So find a local trusted real estate advisor. And if you're um, thinking of buying or selling in Greater Lafayette, Indiana, I would love to be that person for you. Give us a call, 765-427-7000, and have a great start to the new year.